Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up Linktree using the phone app and not the website. There's so many options that are available on the phone app and it works for Android and for iOS as well. So what you want to do is open the Linktree app once you've downloaded it. This is what it will look like. It's green with a little tree icon. You press on it. Then once you do that, this is the opening page. So if you want to scroll, you can do that. Connect your content, grow your following and make and collect money. So I'm going to show you how to set that up so what you want to do is press the sign up button that's down under and it's lower there press on it once you're on the page you see where it says create your account choose your link tree name here called henani home it's my other youtube channel then here you put the email that you want to be using something that you remember and that's easy to remember and if the name that you choose is not taken it will definitely give you a tick if it's not then you to have a red button so you need to choose a name that's for your brand that no one else has and this will help you so Put in your email address then once you do that you press done and you go ahead and you press create account then once you do that you set up a password once you have a good password you press the blue or the purple button depending on how you are seeing it that's written continue So here it says, tell us about yourself. Tell us your name. Here I'm going to be using Henani Home. That is the name of my pages everywhere, all across from YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, everything. It's Henani Home. So here you choose what kind of category that fits your everything that you're doing. So I'm going to choose food and beverage on my end and then pick your creative category. Then here, I'm just going to put home cooking because I am a home cook. You're going to press continue. After you press continue, then you choose whether you want to pay for all or just start with the free one. For now, we are going to start with the free one. And down here, you can go, it says compare plans and they will do a breakdown of what you will get and what you won't get in terms of monetization, customization, analytics, marketing tech, and management. So for now, we are going to use the free version so that we can set this up and so that you can test to see if Linktree is the link in bio that you want to use. Press continue and then it says thank you for signing up to verify your account. Click the link sent to your inbox. So when it sends an email to your email address, this is what it will look like. Hi, Henani. Thanks for signing up. Verify email. Then once you verify the email, then you will go back. Thank you for verifying your email. Then everything is fine and we are back into the app. So the first thing that you want to do, add your Instagram to your link tree, Twitter, anything else like that. So the links that I want to add, I already have in my notepad already saved. So I'm going to copy that link. And then once you are there, you want to press add new link. Then once you do that, this is where you now start to add the links that you want people to focus on. So here I'm going to put a URL. Once I do that, then I press the arrow and then that's what it shows what I eat in a day to lose weight. So what I can do is also just edit what it says. So here I want people to know that this is my latest upload. So every time I upload a new video, I just come and update. So someone that's coming onto my link tree will know what's the latest video that I had. So here on this first link, you can either ask them to use the video itself. So display this video on my link tree or link off to YouTube site, which is exactly what I want. It already picked the thumbnail from the video that I have, which is fine. Then we press done. We've already added the first link. Then the second link I'm going to also just copy. It's a playlist of mine. So the same process, you press the arrow and then you wait for it to automate everything. So when it comes to this link, it just said YouTube. So what you can do is just press on it and then edit what you want it to say. So once you choose a photo, you can change how it looks, then you choose it and then it becomes the thumbnail to this link. And when you're satisfied, you just press done and you can do a preview of every time you update something you press where it says preview and it will show you everything that you are doing then you go back to the links so if you want to move the links in, in accordance to what's important you can just go 
to the side where you see the six dots away from the other side then you just press on it and you drag it so you can move the links according to what's important we're going to add another link so we're going to go ahead and press the button right on top of the screen where it says add new link so you can just allow it to paste press the arrow and then rename the title of your link you just press on it and then you rename it so this is my recipes playlist once i do that i press where it says thumbnail then i choose it and then i wait for it to add thumbnail to this specific link once it's added you just press done so i'm going to add all the other links as we go and then i'm going to move it down because it went to the top Remember in order of importance and how I want them to appear. All right, now we've added all the important links. So if you have a website, you can put it on top. If you have a TikTok, Instagram, anything, a newsletter that you want people to sign up for, this is where you put the links. So people usually say maximum six links. Then it all just depends on what you want to add. The next thing that we're going to do is go where it says appearance. So you go within the order. If you look at the bottom part of your screen, there's links, appearance, appearance preview analytics and more so we're gonna go where it says appearance then after from uh, from appearance now we can add more things so what you want to do is add a profile picture for yourself you're gonna go ahead and press where it says add an image choose from your library or my link tree then i just choose it like i did with all the other images then once we're waiting for it to load you're gonna put your profile title of which everything is the same all across it just makes my life so much easier if you want you can add a bio so i'm just gonna put something quick and now what we're gonna do is pick a brand color or themes you can go ahead and upgrade if you feel you are ready for that step but there's free ones as well that are nice and easy to use you can just pick and see if you like them when you press one you just preview so that you kind of see what you're doing step by step this is the profile that we chose if you're not happy with that you can go ahead and pick other ones as well they have these nice simple colors that are not too too bright or too bold and then you just see if this is what you like if that's not what you like you can go down you can customize your appearance you can have a gradient if you want or a flat color and then choose the kind of background that you want and you can pick buttons as well so maybe you choose a gradient then you can choose the colors that you want maybe you want like a green color going down you can confirm once you confirm you go ahead and you preview what you have chosen and this is what it looks like so it gives you many options to see what you would like and if you want to add anything to the buttons so that they come to life and they are much more lively you can go ahead and go where it says fill outline hard shadow or soft shadow i can pick one of these and whatever that you do you just go where it says preview next to appearance and you can see everything that you are doing once you choose if that to hard shadow then you choose the color of the button the button font color and the button shadow color especially if you have chosen things with hard shadows so you can change the button color and this is what it looks like then you can change the text color the font color itself i just want it to be nice and black and nice and clear you preview it and everything is looking nice and simple you have your profile and you have the theme and you have the bio you have all your links set up in one space that you are happy with the next thing that we want to do is go where it says more and then here on more you can see some things are open and some things are not open if you want mailing list integrations it's logged we're just gonna go where it's open we go where it says social icons so you can choose to have your social icons below the links or above we're gonna choose above and here you can put your social medias that you want to focus on so you can scroll they have all the way from amazon all the way down to your youtube so we're gonna add as we go so we copy the facebook url and we paste it instagram username so you put your at if you want to link your paypal venmo or cash app you just put the url there tiktok username also have a tiktok page so once you paste and you are happy with everything else you press done on top then we're gonna go and come back where it says preview and there we go all you just need to do is when the person opens they will just press on the icon and it will take them to the specific page that you want nice and easy
you will see your link tree will now pop up on any other social media that you want to put it on once you press on it there we go your link tree is nice and set up this is how you set up your link tree using your phone app let me know how it was for you to set up your link tree using this video otherwise i'll see you in my next one thanks so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe